Yeah. Uh, we are going to talk about Barry Manilow for a moment. Uh, he's on stage tonight mm -hmm. back at the International Theater. Uh, so much going on this weekend. I know that you are judging the uh, American Idol contest. Wet n Wild's uh, Idol, Vegas Idol competition is happening 2 p.m. on Saturday. Yeah. Fun. And mm -hmm. you know what? This is the kickoff of the water parks. Like Certainly this is, is the big weekend. This is the time. It's so exciting. I mentioned I'm going to see Mr. Matt Goss at the mm -hmm. Mirage tomorrow mm -hmm. night. Looking forward to doing that. Uh, Barry Manilow, um, just a lovely guy, mm -hmm. lovely guy. I did end up, you and I talked about how many jingles he's written for oh, television. Oh, goodness, yeah. So, I mean, such a such an incredibly talented man, decades of not only singing, entertaining people, but songwriting as well. I got to spend a few brilliant moments with him over at the Westgate. Let's take a look. How's We're having a nice talk trouble? here. Run that camera. <laughs> I chatted with the legendary singer-songwriter Barry Manilow just days before he kicked off his new residency at the Westgate Las Vegas. You know, I'm still on the road, not as much as I used to be, but I'm still on the road. And the road gets to you now and again, you know, city to city, you know, airplanes, hotels and all. Uh, this is the perfect answer for me, for my band, to have a residency, the same place to go. You're making this stage look good, I have to tell you. Yeah, but you know how many great legends have played on this stage. It was Barbara opened it, you know, and then Elvis, please, Elvis had a long run here. Everybody from Aretha to Michael Bublé, everybody has played on this stage. So this time I'm going for my catalog. Uh, I'm one of the lucky guys who has a catalog of songs that a lot of people know, and I'm trying to do all of them. <laughs> Performing all his hits, I just hope he does my favorite, Copacabana. No kidding. No. Come on, you can do better than that. No, I, well, right? I'll tell you why I love it. Okay. I love it because it's a dance song. Yeah. It is a dance Everybody song. Everybody loves a dance song. You're yeah. right. And you know, when it came out, I, nobody thought that that could be a hit from me because I was known for, you know, it was only about five years, but I was like the ballad guy, you know, and people loved those ballads. And so when I put out Copa, they thought it was an album cut and they would never make it. The record company didn't believe in it, but the public loved it. I'm going to ask you to do a dance move with me if you're willing. If Whatever you're willing. Whatever you want. Look, you're such a beautiful Darling. person. All right. Okay. Yes. That would be advisable. Do I have to take my mic off too? Her name was Lola. She was a showgirl with yellow feathers in her hair and a dress cut down. Wow, and she went both ways. Cha cha. And while she's you're just dipping your way through the entire city, it's amazing. <laughs> <laughs> well done. Isn't well that done. Great? That's very cool. He's such a nice man. He is very like, nice. Really a nice man. Mm -hmm. mm. That's right. Fun. Again, Barry returns tonight through Sunday inside the Westgate. Ticket information's up on their, your screen. He's also coming back in June and then all throughout the summer and the fall. He'll have dates there as well. So check him out. You so did, many hits. You got dipped by Barry Manilow. I did. It was great.